1984, the world of cinema was graced with the release of Amadeus, a film that would go on to become one of the most celebrated and critically acclaimed movies of its time. Directed by Milos Forman and adapted from Peter Schaffer's stage play, Amadeus brought the dramatic life and enigmatic persona of Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart to the silver screen in a way that captivated audiences and critics alike. The origin of Amadeus began with Peter Schaffer's fascination with Mozart's music and the intriguing dynamics between Mozart and his contemporary, Antonio Salieri. Schaffer's play, first performed in 1979, depicted Salieri as a bitter rival who, consumed by jealousy, seeks to destroy Mozart. The play was a tremendous success, winning numerous awards and drawing the attention of Hollywood. Milos Forman, a director known for his ability to capture complex human emotions, was approached to helm the film adaptation. Forman, already acclaimed for his work on One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, was intrigued by the rich narrative and emotional depth of Schaffer's play. He saw the potential to create a film that would not only entertain, but also explore profound themes of genius, envy, and the human condition. The screenplay for Amadeus was adapted by Schaffer himself, ensuring that the film retained the dramatic intensity and intellectual rigor of the original play. The story is told through the eyes of Salieri, portrayed by F. Murray Abraham, who confesses his envy and hatred for Mozart, played by Tom Hulse, to a priest. The narrative structure, with its use of flashbacks, allows for a deep exploration of Salieri's inner turmoil and his complex relationship with Mozart. Casting was a critical component of bringing Amadeus to life. F. Murray Abraham's portrayal of Salieri is both haunting and empathetic, earning him an Academy Award for Best Actor. Tom Hulse's energetic and charismatic performance as Mozart provided a stark contrast to Salieri's brooding presence, highlighting the brilliance and tragedy of Mozart's short life. The production of Amadeus was a meticulous endeavor. Foreman insisted on shooting in Prague, Czechoslovakia, now the Czech Republic, to capture the authentic atmosphere of 18th century Vienna. The film's elaborate sets and period-accurate costumes contributed to its visual splendor, immersing audiences in the world of classical music and high society. The film's soundtrack, featuring Mozart's compositions, was integral to its storytelling. Conductor Neville Mariner and the Academy of St. Martin in the Fields brought Mozart's music to life, weaving it seamlessly into the narrative. The soundtrack not only underscored the emotional arcs of the characters, but also served as a character in its own right, representing Mozart's genius. Upon its release on September 19, 1984, Amadeus received universal acclaim. Critics praised its performances, direction, screenplay, and visual and auditory craftsmanship. The film dominated the 57th Academy Awards, winning eight Oscars, including Best Picture, Best Director for Foreman, and Best Adapted Screenplay for Schaffer. Amadeus transcended its status as a historical drama, becoming a cultural touchstone. It sparked renewed interest in Mozart's music and life, making classical music accessible to a broader audience. The film's exploration of themes such as jealousy, mediocrity versus genius, and the cost of artistic brilliance resonated deeply with viewers. The legacy of Amadeus endures as a masterpiece of cinema. It remains a poignant and beautifully crafted film that captures the spirit of its subjects and the era they lived in. Through its powerful storytelling and masterful execution, Amadeus continues to inspire and captivate new generations of film lovers and music enthusiasts.